Hey guys, how's it all going? Today I'm going to show you how to get a Fraps video into Lightworks for editing. Lightworks is a professional editor, it's available for free off their website lwks.com. There's a free version and a pro version and the difference between the two is the types of output formats that you can export to. If you're new to Lightworks, stick with the free version while you're learning and check out their tutorials because that'll help you get, get up to speed really quickly. There is a steep learning curve so just be patient with it. Now when you record videos with Fraps, what Fraps will do is it will save that video file as a variable frame rate. And that's a problem for Lightworks because Lightworks doesn't really like variable frame rates very much. So I'm going to import a Fraps file here. You can see it's the FPS1 encoder which means it's directly from Fraps. And I'm just going to click import. You can see here that it's create link, I'm not transcoding it or anything. Normally when you try to transcode a Fraps file, um, bad things will happen, I'll show you that later, but I'm just going to straight up import it right now. So that dropped in fine, and you would think, ah, oh, everything's fine, you play it back. You might notice a few frame stutters here and there, but nothing too bad, so it might even escape your attention. But I can promise you that there's going to be problems when you export this. So I'm just going to play it back for a little bit more, and I'm going to stop it there, I'm going to mark out and I'm going to export that portion of the video and I'm going to export it for YouTube at 59.94 frames per second you can't actually do a straight up 60 so that's close enough size 1080p and I use the mark section start and it's going to take a little while once that's finished exporting you can actually view the video file oh, okay. <laughs> And you can see that the frame is stuttering from time to time and it's really annoying. So the worst thing is if you have you haven't picked it up, you haven't noticed it, you've edited your video files and then you export it only to have this weird stutter. So how do we fix that? What we need to do is we need to convert the Fraps video file from a variable frame rate into a new video file which has a constant frame rate. And I do that using Handbrake. You could try the transcode option in Lightworks, but I'll show you right now what, what the problem with that is. So I am going to try importing the same file, but I'm going to try the transcode option in Lightworks, and what Lightworks will try to do is it will try to transcode the Fraps file into a, a Lightworks friendly file. And I'm just going to click import. It's going to do its thing and it's going to take a little while again. So once Lightworks has finished transcoding, you can check the result by double clicking on the newly imported file and you can see here that hasn't really worked for me. It's upside down and it's all green. More often than not, I will get this kind of result, but sometimes Lightworks will actually import and transcode a Fraps file perfectly. But this, the majority of the time I have found that I get this result. So what I do is I use handbrake to convert the original fraps file which is a variable frame rate into a new video file which has a constant frame rate and you can do that just by clicking constant frame rate here i like to select the frame rates manually you can keep it same as source if you want um, but i'm going to actually transcode my file into 59.94 frames per second and the reason i do that is because if you check the export settings in lightworks it's going to export to 59.94 frames per second as well. So I like to keep the source file and the final file the same frame rate if at all possible. So I'm going to open up Lightworks again. I've already preloaded the source and I've already set the destination file. So I'm just going to click start and let it encode. Now once Handbrake has finished encoding you can now import that new file into Lightworks so I'm just going to go import this is the file here and I'm going to import it as a link now importing it as a link is very fast to get it into Lightworks and start editing straight away the only problem with that is that Lightworks is very slow with the mp4 playback mp4 isn't a, a very good format for playback it actually taxes the computer quite a bit so you can see here that the uh, the playback isn't smooth and during editing that can get really frustrating 
So what I suggest you do, instead of a straight import, I'm just going to remove that. Instead of a straight import, I suggest that you actually do transcode the handbrake file. Once Lightworks has finished transcoding, you can open up the newly transcoded handbrake file and play it back. And you'll notice that it plays back a lot more smoothly. That will make things a lot easier to edit. So that's how you get a craps video into Lightworks for editing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys later.